hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and i am amit kumar today i am going to teach you how to create downloadable links using html5 okay so let's see how you can do that using html5 without using php driven scripts okay html5 provides a new attribute for anchor tag which is download attribute which help you to create your downloadable links for example let's say you create a link for an image to preview in your browser and what you want when you click on that image you want that image to be downloaded instead of navigating to its full preview so let me show you what i am talking about let's say i have created a link for an image for example let's say i create a link for image logo.png which is located in my directory where this file has been saved in my case it's c sts directory okay so that's why i'm writing the name of that file only and let's uh, save it and close that anchor tag and give it download text save it and navigate to your file when I click on this file it's gonna navigate to that file instead of downloading this here you see that but what I want here I want when I click on this download link okay I want this image to be downloaded let's say instead of this download text I want to include my actual logo image img and give it a source of logo.png again and close this tag give it an alternative text of thumbnail so that when I click on this image thumbnail it's gonna download this image uh, and let's give it a width of only 120 pixels okay and hit save run it again in your browser by pressing ctrl alt shift x if you are running in notepad and when you click on this thumbnail you will again navigate it to that image file preview okay so to download this file you can just go ahead and apply an attribute called download download okay this attribute download attribute let me increase some text size so you guys can see it clearly this download attribute hit save now again go ahead and hit refresh by pressing f5 and again click on this file and you're gonna see that you will be prompted to download this file and save it to your hard disk okay now i want you to notice this name which is logo.png which is the actual name for that file here logo.png but i want this file name to be changed during download okay so i can just go ahead and apply a value for my download attribute and give it a name what i want to call it let's say i want to call it my logo and save it okay now again just go ahead and hit refresh in your browser and again click on this link and you're gonna see that the name that you have specified in your download attribute in my case my logo and you can now save this file and preview in your image viewer uh, in case whatever you prefer windows photo viewer okay so that's how you can use uh, html5 download attribute to download your file let's say i want to download a music file here yeah. so what i can do here i can just go ahead and type the name of uh, my mp3 file or music file here yeah, which is here in my case gutter brothers copy the link uh, file name go ahead and paste it here and specify the file name file type which is mp3 okay this time it should be download again 
and let's cancel this value for now and it's instead of this image thumbnail we're gonna give it a name I think let's give it download music okay and close the anchor tag save it again go ahead to your browser hit refresh now click on this download music link and you're gonna see that you are prompted to download this music file and name of the file is still the same as for the original file name okay so let's cancel it again let's see what happens when I just go ahead and remove this download attribute okay save it go to your browser hit refresh and when I click on this music file it's gonna navigate to that new music file in, and play that music instead of downloading okay so it's going to play that file instead of downloading let's go ahead and change the name for download file when, when it is prompted to download so let's give it a name just gutter brothers okay and again go to your browser and hit refresh again and now you can see the name only provided to this file is gutter brothers now you can save this file by hitting save file so this is how you can use html5 download attribute remember it's a global attribute in html5 and it's a new attribute and some new developers are not familiar with this attributes and they are still using uh, php driven script to download their files and i think html5 has provided and promises this new attribute will help you to download your files without relying on php driven scripts okay so guys if you like this video please hit like to this video and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel if you really want to see some more videos like this one thank you bye bye